بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم رب زدني علما now the next thing we'll try to understand the different interface states so generally all the interfaces of stp will have different states like here we have seen some of them disable state means typically the port which is in the shutdown state or maybe not connected so if you don't connect any particular port let's say so this port may be port number 20 not connected to any device so typically this port will not participate in the spanning tree so there is no spanning tree works or or you can say simply the port which is in a shutdown state so that particular port will not receive any any kind of bpdus or send any bpdus or if there is no connection there is no point it will learn any kind of mac addresses or update the mac table or forward the packets so that is one kind of uh, port state you will find the other one is blocking state we discussed the blocking port now the blocking port is your alternate port like when you have two paths one will be forwarding other will be blocking so we have seen this already so when when the port is in the blocking state it will still receive the bpdus because typically the root bridge will be sending the bpdus so it is going to listen to this bpdus receive the bpdus but it will not forward any bpdus so basically bpdus are not sent out of the blocking ports and of course it will not learn any mac addresses or it will not forward any traffic so everything will be blocked the only difference between the disable and the blocking is the blocking port will still receive the bpdus because it is like a keep alive to confirm whether this particular path is this particular route is working or not and the other states we have seen forwarding means you know normally the port which is forwarding the traffic which will be forwarding the data or the frames and of course it will learn the mac addresses and update the mac table and the send and receive the uh, bpdus normally so the forwarding port will be sending and receiving the bpdus so typically your designated ports or the root ports generally we call it as so these are actually the interface states now there are two more states you will see now these two states you will see listening and learning this is typically during the convergence time so they are not like permanent because you can have a blocking port for a long time so disable port like you know maybe the port is not connected for a long time or the port can be in the blocking for a long time or forwarding but generally you will see this listening and the learning states will be for for a specific time period and that is for 15 seconds and 15 seconds normally and this happens at the time of convergence when you connect a new link or whenever any any forwarding any main link fails then it is going to when it is converging from blocking to the forwarding ports so in those kind of scenarios and the difference is the port will be uh, first it will be listening so in the listening state it is more like a blocking state so if you observe this listening and learning listening and blocking so it is going to still receive the bpdus during the listening process and it will be sending the bpdus so it will be sending and receiving the bpdus normally but it is not going to learn the mac addresses so it is not going to update the mac table or if any mac mac addresses are learned on that particular port let's say if there are mac table will not be updated or not learned even it will not forward any traffic so during this listening state the traffic is not forwarded okay of course it is not going to learn the mac addresses also but it will be sending and receiving the bpdus that is required for the for the path selection process okay so if there is any older older mac entries generally that will be um, removed so basically it will remove any kind of older mac entries for which the no frames will be received for each uh, mac addresses during this period but whereas once it once it finishes this listening state for the 15 seconds next it will go to the learning state so in this learning state it will still send and receive the bpdus same like listening but it will start updating the mac addresses so it will learn the mac addresses of those frames and it will update them in the mac table but again still it will not forward the traffic so the traffic is only forwarded when it is in the forwarding state so after listening after learning it will go to forwarding so this is the process right normally it will take 30 seconds and that's the reason whenever you connect any new link like i showed you here whenever you connect any new link let's say if i connect a computer or any particular switch the default process is every port will go to listening and learning that is what we call as forwarding delay before it decides the port into assigns the port into forwarding state 
So during this process, it has to uh, update the entries. So basically, it has to figure out the path, the STP calculation process during this process.